गुड आफ्टरनून ऑल ऑफ यू इन लास्ट प्रैक्टिकल आई हैव डिस्कस द एक्सपेरिमेंट इंट्रोडक्शन सिलेबस एंड द एक्सपेरिमेंट नंबर वन दैट इज टू प्रिपेयर इवेल्युएट एंड सबमिट ट्वेंटी एम ऑफ सिंपल सीरप आईपी टुडे वी विल सी द नेक्स्ट एक्सपेरिमेंट दैट इज टू प्रिपेयर इवेल्युएट एंड सबमिट ट्वेंटी एम ऑफ पिप्राजीन साइट्रेट इलिग्जर आई सो वॉट इज इलिग्जर यस I will define the elixir. The elixirs are the sweetened aromatic hydroalcoholic preparations which are meant or uh, which are used for oral use. Then, the medicated elixirs are the elixir which contain the any medicinal substances or the API or the any medicament. Then, the elixir contain ethyl alcohol. However, the alcohol contain it will be vary the elixir contain only small quantity of those it contain this considerable portions as a necessary to add its solubility the elixir may also contain the glycerin and the syrup which may be added to increase the solubility of medicinal agent yes i am repeating here the elixirs are also contain what glycerin and the syrups why the glycerin and syrups are added because it increases the solubility of medicinal agents or if these are added for a sweetening purpose the some elixirs contain propylene glycol and some come with this solvent are satisfactory substitute for both glycerin and the alcohol although the alcohol is an excellent solvent for some drug it doesn't that the salon test of bromides and the similar salts so the met then the classification of elixir the non medicated elixir and the medicated elixir so what is non medicated elixir these are used as a solvent or vehicle for the preparation of medical medicated elixirs so what is non medicated elixir these are the elixir which does not contain any medicinal substance or the active pharmaceutical ingredient and they are used as a solvent or the vehicle for for the preparation of the formulation of medicated elixir examples of non medicated elixir aromatic elixir usp then isoalcoholic elixir anap that is national formulary then the active ingredient dissolved in solution that contain 15 to 50 percent by volume of ethyl alcohol the next that is medicated elixir these are the elixir which contain any medicinal substance or the drug or the any active pharmaceutical ingredient examples of medicated elixir antihistamine antihistamine elixir then piprazine cited elixir so what are the advantages of elixir for that is insoluble drug compound can be first advantage of elixir the insoluble drug compound can be incorporated into the hydroalcoholic vehicle because in definition as i discussed earlier it is hydroalcoholic formulations first advantage that is insoluble drug compounds can be incorporated into the hydroalcoholic vehicles then it is possible to prepare a drug concentrate in a alcohol containing elixirs then third advantage hydroalcoholic vehicle can self preserving it means this elixir in elixir there is no need of addition of preservative because it is hydroalcoholic this alcohol it it act as a preservative that is self preserving or the self preserving next advantage elixirs are less viscous and it contain a low lower portion of sugar and it contain a lower portion of sugar then this advantage of this elixir is not suitable for pediatric and pediatric and patient on antidepressant medications then next disadvantage improper storage may result in variation of concentration of active and inactive ingredients then alcohol evaporation may result in precipitation of water soluble drugs then 
सिंस इट कंटेन वोलेटाइल मटेरियल्स इट मस्ट बी स्टोर्ड इन ए वोटर टाइट स्क्रू टॉप जार एंड अवे फ्रॉम सोर्स ऑफ इग्निशन देन वॉट इज यूज ऑफ दिस इलिग्जर द नॉन मेडिकेटेड इलिग्जर दैट इज एरोमेटिक इलिग्जर सर्व एज अ फ्लेवर्ड वेहीकल वाइल मेडिकेटेड इलिग्जर आर यूज और जनरली इट कंसिस्ट ऑफ ड्रग्स इन विच सच एज सेडेटिव हिप्नोटिक एंड एंटी हिस्टाम सो एम ऑफ दिस प्रैक्टिकल दैट इज टू प्रिपेयर दिस इज ऑल अबाउट थेरेटिकल पार्ट ऑफ योर इलिग्जर दैट आई हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस इन थेरी एंड ऑल्सो योर प्रैक्टिकल टू प्रिपेयर यू वेल टाइम सबमिट ट्वेंटी एम एल ऑफ पिप्राजिन साइटेड इलिग्जर आई पी then requirement for this practical for that is chemical the piprazin citrate then chloroform spirit glycerin orange oil syrup and purified water then apparatus or the glass vase beaker measuring cylinder pipette glass rod motor and pestle spatula so these are the requirements of the glass vase and chemicals which are required for this practical then what is formula for this the piprazin citrate then chloroform spirit glycerin orange oil syrup and purified water the piprazin citrate it is 150 g this formula for this values of this quantities for 1000 ml and you have to, you have to prepare only 20 ml it means for example piprazin citrate 150 g this value it means the 150 it is for 1000 ml then how much for 20 ml cross multiplication then orange oil 0.25 ml then chloroform spirit 5 ml glycerin 100 ml syrup 500 ml and purified water it is 1000 ml this piprazin citrate elixir is used as a anti helminthic to expel the worm from a intestine then in this formulation the piprazin citrate is used or the piprazin is used in a salt form in a, yes it is used in a salt form that is citrate form and it is soluble in a purified water so what is use of piprazin citrate that is it is medicinal substance or the api it is used as a anti helminthic so then use of orange oil it is flavoring agent then use of chloroform spirit it is preservative then use of glycerin it is humectant it means it to maintain the moisture then syrup the use of syrup that is sweetener and use of purified water that is vehicle the glycerin it also serve as a co solvent and also enhance the solubility of drug then chloroform spirit it act as a preservative then syrup it act as a sweetener and purified water it act as a vehicle so next that is procedure dissolve the piprazin citrate in a few part of water then add orange oil glycerin then syrup and chloroform spirit into the above solution first step that is to dissolve first the way the accurate quantity of piprazin citrate and dissolve in few part of water then stir it after dissolution add orange oil glycerin syrup and chloroform spirit into the above solution then add or if the if it is necessary filter the solution if it is not necessary there is no need of filtration then add sufficient quantity of water in order to produce the required volume required volume it means you have to prepare only 20 ml and this formula for and this formula is given for 1000 ml required volume it means it is your 20 ml so order the evolution parameter that is volume of course it is 20 ml then order color clarity and ph this evolution par parameters you have to check its volume of course it is 20 ml then order color clarity and ph so it is storage condition of the container and storage it is stored in tightly closed amber glass bottle and keep away from the light 
so what is use of the category of this elixir that is anti helminthic then what is special direction for this the for external or the for internal use only or the close the container tightly after their use of course it is for internal use only and this direction is always written in red pen and always it is written in a capital letter so the direction that is for internal use only and this direction is always written in red pen along with capital all capital letter and so what is diesel for this that is thus that 20 ml of fiprazine cited elixir was prepared evaluated and submitted carefully